Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to make a leaflet on Canva. The first thing you will need to do is sign up on Canva which you can do for completely free using your email address. Once you have done that you are going to tap on the search bar and from here I want you to type in leaflet. And the reason why you're typing in leaflet is because with Canva, they provide you with numerous templates that makes it easy for anyone to create a beautiful leaflet or any design. As you can see right here, there are over a thousand templates that you can choose from. And by the way, anyone that you see with a dollar sign or with a crown, that means that you would have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular template. But there are numerous free templates that you can choose from, as you can see right here. So it all depends on the reason why you want a leaflet. For example, if you are create one, creating one for healthy food, you'll choose that particular one. If you are creating one for business or for school, you can choose a different one. So you can scroll down and you can look on the different leaflets as you can see right here. Here is one for business if you are looking to create one for your business. So once you have found one that you like, for example, this one right here, all you'll have to do is tap on that particular template. After you have done that, you're going to tap on customize this template. After selecting customize this template, you'll be redirected to a new page as you can see right here. And from here, we'll be able to customize the template and add our own personal touch to our leaflet. So you can see how the leaflet looks at the moment and you can see it right here. And also if you would like to use Canva to do your printing, you can also do that. As you can see right here, they are showing that they offer free delivery and you can get over 50 trifolds printed for $23 as you can see right here. So if you'd like to use them, you can. But for this example, I'll be showing you how to create it. So the first thing you want to do Let's say, for example, you want to add your logo, as you can see right here. You can tap right here and you could type in your logo. Let's say I want to put in Simple Answers. Then after doing that, you can also change the text section. All you have to do is tap on the text box and from there you can type in whatever you want. And you can also change the size of the font by tapping on font size in the top left hand corner. And also if you would like to change the font style, you can also do that. All you have to do is highlight the entire text box. Then you are going to go over to the top left hand corner. And right where you see poppins on my screen, you would tap right there. After selecting that, you can see the different font styles that you can choose from. And once you have tapped on a font style, you can see right there that the font style has now changed. And it is quite easy to edit. And again, if you would like to change any of the images, let's say I want to use a different image right here. You have two options. You can either select upload and add an image from your computer or your laptop whatever you are using or you can select elements in the top left hand corner and let's say for example I want to add some fruits all I have to do is tap on fruit then I can select fruit bowl after selecting fruit bowl you can see the different images and you can select photos right here after selecting photos I could add this particular photo by simply tapping on it and pulling it right there and you can see that the image has changed. And again, if I would like to change this image right here, I can add another image from Canva. All I have to do is simply select the image, this one, then I could place it right there. And you can see how it looks right there. And let's say I want to change this image also. I want to add something else. Let's say I want to add this. All I'll have to do is tap and place it. And you can see right there, it looks beautiful. And by the way, if you would like to change the color of any section, all you have to do is tap on the section that you would like to change the color. Then you're going to tap on the color box in the top left hand corner. 
So let's say, for example, I want to change this section to this red right here. I can simply tap on it and you can see that it has changed. Again, if you like to change the color of this section also, you can. All you have to do is highlight the section. Then from there, you can tap on the color. And by the way, if you don't see a color that you'd like to use, all you have to do is scroll up to the top. Then in the top left hand corner, you're going to tap on the plus right where you see add new color. And from there, you can select a particular color as you can see right there. And it is quite easy to edit. Once you're finished editing, all you'll have to do now is go over to the top right hand corner and you're going to select share. After selecting share, from here, you're going to scroll down. And you can select to print your design or if you would like to download it you could tap on download then you'll tap on download right here and that's it once it has been downloaded you'll be able to share it with others or you'll be able to print it and also if you would like to create a new page you can you can simply tap on add page right here and you could create a second template or if you would like to copy this particular one all you have to do is go up to the top right hand corner right above the template and you could select duplicate page and you can see right there that the page has been duplicated and then from here you could make all of your changes and create a second by a second page right here once you have finished again you can print it hope you found this video helpful and informative if you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.